Hello everybody, Dan here. Welcome back to Daily Soap Dish. If you're new here, please hit that subscribe button down below because we cover a ton of 90 Day Fiancé right here on the channel. All right, guys, so let's get into it. Today we have a story for you about Amanda and her Romanian ex, Razvan Chokoi. Now, if you guys remember the storyline, it was a bit of a messy one. Amanda had just recently lost her husband and the father of her kids. Uh, and shortly afterwards, she hooked up with Razvan, and a lot of people uh, were kind of criticizing and slamming her for really moving pretty quickly and hooking up with this guy, this Romanian guy that really looked like he was all into himself and not that much uh, into Amanda. And so people were bashing Amanda for making silly and stupid decisions when she had kids uh, to take care of. So the whole thing was a bit of a mess. These two called it off, but... Razvan right now is actually in the USA. So what exactly is going on? Let's take a look at this piece right here and we'll give you guys an update on Razvan and on this couple. So uh, Razvan Chokoy reveals exciting new living situation after Amanda split. Razvan isn't living in Romania anymore. The 90 Day Fiance before the 90 Day Star has moved to one of the most popular cities in the world. And you probably guessed it, it's NYC. Razvan Chokoy uh, has successfully made it to the United States, as confirmed by his recent photos and videos from NYC. Uh, fans were thrilled to see Razvan in the U.S. and congratulated him on his move, encouraging him to pursue his modeling career and enjoy his time in New York City. While there are concerns that Razvan may try to reconnect with his former partner Amanda Wilhelm, Many viewers believe it would not be a good idea for them to reconcile and hope that Razvan focuses on his career and personal growth in America. Now, uh, Razvan Chokoy uh, from uh, before the 90 days uh, has made it uh, to the USA since parting, uh, parting ways with his American partner. The 26-year-old remains... Is he still 26? I, I swear to God, this, this age is wrong. This guy looks at least... 10 years older than 26 there is no way this guy is 26 but he was if he was 26 for real he's probably about 27 28 by now now uh he joined um uh, part of the spinoff in mid uh, 2023 uh he joined uh the show alongside his 31 year old widow girlfriend amanda who seemed like an ideal match for him unfortunately things didn't go well for the two when she arrived in romania amanda realized that Razvan couldn't replace her husband yet she didn't sponsor him, but asked him to meet her once he had come to the USA on an artist visa. Now, recently, Razvan posted a few photo photos and videos of himself in NYC, confirming that he had indeed made it to the USA. He shared a clip of himself on October 27, calling America his home. So let's take a look at what it says here. So uh, I don't know if you guys can hear this. Oh, yeah, he's playing. Uh, OK, he's playing Empire State of Mind. So I'm not going to play that because I'll get hit for copyrights. But you can see him. He's in, uh, you know, he's in a helicopter ride over NYC. I saw this clip a, a couple of days ago and he posted more stuff. So we'll get into that in a little bit. There's a Statue of Liberty and uh, he says he's home. Now, this doesn't really say if uh, he is moving to the USA or if he's there on an artist visa or a tourist visa. I'm not exactly sure that we know the full details of his visit to the USA is Amanda meeting him. Let's see if we can get more information on that. Later, he shared a video of himself walking up in a minimal modern apartment and walking near Times Square. He captioned his post with Good Morning New York, showing his excitement about finally achieving his big milestone. The young Romanian actor also shared a selfie from Central Park, letting 90 Day fian uh, Fiance fans know that he was happier than ever. Now, anticipation has been building over Razvan possibly announcing his move since before the 90 days concluded. Therefore, fans were delighted to see him in the USA uh, and congratulated him. Some uh, user said, so pleased for you, telling Razvan to go and get his modeling career started quickly. Another user commented, looks like you're loving it here and suggested that the reality star uh, should have fun in NYC. So a lot of happy comments. I'm actually kind of surprised by that because I didn't get the feeling that this guy... Uh, you know, I, I felt more like he was a bit of a villain because to me, it really felt like he was using Amanda more than anything. And to use a widow, you know, her husband just recently passed away to, to use her to try to get some clout, to try to get some fame, I think it's pretty low. So I'm kind of surprised that he has good comments unless these are just a couple and there are plenty more that are not positive or maybe he just deleted those. I'm not exactly sure. But in my opinion, I wasn't sure that I really liked Razvan and I wasn't sure that I trusted his motivations. You guys let me know what you think about that in the comment section. 
Now, from Rizvan's former ex, Amanda, to fellow gym bro, Rishi Singh, many cast members responded to the post with likes. Since Rizvan is now in the U.S., some of his followers worry that he may try to get back with Amanda. On 90 Day Fiancé, the Romanian man was deeply in love with the single mother and wanted to make things work. While Amanda claims they are now just friends, things may change in the coming months. The two may try to reconnect and reconcile, which would probably not be a good idea for them. I kind of agree with that. Now, Rizvan has grown a lot in recent months. He's probably working on building his career in the U.S. and forming professional relationships. He knows his struggles with Amanda and may not want to end up with her again. Moreover, he may not want to date right now because he hasn't settled in yet. He will surely grow in the U.S. and, um, you know, become uh, the performer he always hoped to. So, uh, first things about this this whole post here that, that we just went over. This feels overly optimistic overly positive <laughs> i'm not sure that i agree with the tone of this article uh because like i said i feel like razvan is a cloud chaser and i feel like he's a user and uh i never really felt like he had good intentions i mean just on the show itself he was introduced as an actor but then we learned that he was actually acting in what was basically soft porn movies like he was acting almost fully naked with other women and Amanda had a huge problem with that and that was a, re a reason for a lot of their friction was that his whole modeling career is more like a soft porn career and Amanda of course did not really enjoy that and I don't exactly blame her so here we see him in NYC uh, he is uh, posting some pictures um, you know from Central Park uh, and um I guess he was in Munich. He was probably there on a stopover because this was five days ago. So he probably stopped over in Munich. And that was the video that he posted about making it to NYC. Uh, good morning, New York. And uh, he's filming himself right there. And uh, you could see what he's doing in, in NYC. Like I said, we don't. Oh, was that Amanda? Let's play that again. I, I don't know if that was Amanda that we saw there. And I'm going to try to stop it. I don't think it is. I think it's just a random woman. But. Let's see. Okay, here we go. Right there. I don't know. I don't think that's Amanda. I, I swear, I, I thought for a second that the face looked like Amanda, but I don't think it is. Unless that is like a little Easter egg that he's posting in his video. Uh, I don't really think that Amanda would have the time. Of course, she has young kids, so she doesn't really have the time to just kind of, you know, she already went to Romania. Now take more time off to go to NYC, uh, you know, to kind of, rekindle a relationship that failed that wouldn't seem like a good idea uh, in my opinion and here you have him posing in nyc uh and uh you know he's saying that he's waited for this uh, his whole life and uh yvette you know is posting a comment right there so he's he's very happy to be in nyc like i said i'm not exactly sure uh if he is there on what kind of visa he's there and so on and so forth you never know he might rekindle his relationship with Amanda. What do you guys make of that? Do you guys think that these two would ever have a chance of making it work once again? And here we're taking a look at uh, Amanda's Instagram. Uh, and you can see that she's celebrating Halloween with her kids. So this was four days ago. Uh, and she is posting about, you know, mom life and, and stuff like that. I really don't think that that was Amanda in the video there, but uh, I think it was a false alarm. Uh, and she's posting uh, some stuff here. I'm not exactly sure who this guy is right there. But there we see her dressed up for Halloween. Um, you know, there you go. I'm not sure who this guy is. Is that her new boyfriend? I actually really don't know. I really don't know. So perhaps it, it's, it's a non-issue anyways. Perhaps Amanda already has. Or is that? Oh, I think this. I think these are throwbacks. Uh, let's see here. Yeah. So these are throwbacks with her husband. Right. Because I, I, I knew I recognized this guy. These are throwbacks with her uh, with her ex-husband that uh, tragically passed away. So, um, yeah, I guess you never really know uh, if they could rekindle their relationship. Because you see here that her kids are a lot older, of course. Uh, but I just don't think that these two ever uh, were meant for each other. So, that's the video for today, guys. Just wanted to bring you this update about Razvan in the USA. Like I said, we don't know if he's there just 
temporarily. We don't know if he's there more permanently. Uh, we don't really have uh, any idea right now. If we do, we'll update you guys uh, and let you guys know uh, what you think. Of course, it's obvious, I think, just judging by what we're seeing on his Instagram profile, that his ultimate goal, of course, was to get to the USA. That's really what he wanted all along. And he's going to do it either with Amanda or without Amanda as in this case so if he can do it without her if he can get you know a, a artist visa i'm not exactly sure that he would qualify because well i guess maybe if you're a model you can get it but i i assume that he would have to have some kind of paid gigs where they would have to perhaps sponsor him um and um you know based on his modeling career where he's kind of modeling half naked and so on and so forth i guess you never really know what's going on behind the scenes my theory is that he's just there temporarily perhaps on a tourist visa and perhaps he's trying to see if he can stay there longer perhaps he's going to try to hook up with amanda again to extend the stay or perhaps he's trying to hook up with somebody else right because that's always a possibility and try to extend his stay that way you guys let me know what you think about this whole thing in the comment section down below did you enjoy these two when they came on the show what did you think about Amanda kind of moving on from her husband, from her late husband, so quickly with Resvan? And she kind of tried to sweep it a little bit under the rug because if I remember correctly, she moved on about two months or so after her husband passed away. Uh, but she was trying to kind of muddy the timeline a little bit to make it seem like it was longer. So a lot of people slammed her for that. You guys let me know what you make of that in the comment section down below. And do you guys want to see either Amanda or Resvan back on the show in the future let me know what you think in the comment section down below that's gonna do it for today hope you guys enjoyed the video give it a big thumbs up if you did please hit that subscribe button down below for more content right here and i will see you guys very soon take care